friends, the lesson I'm going to show you is called the Red Rods. What is that? You'll see. I love this work so much. This work is gonna be for one friend at a time. I'm gonna show you how to bring over the Red Rods and I might invite some friends to help me, but please don't get up or touch any of the work unless I say your name. First, I'm gonna ask if my friend Lola will bring over a rug. Yeah. Thank you so much, my friend. Somebody rolled it really nicely. Please watch the way I carry these rods. One at a time. Two hands to carry them. like this because if I carry it like this no. I might bump somebody no. so carry it like this yeah. do you see how slowly I'm walking they're getting so long aren't they to walk so carefully with this one. for the longest one. Logan, put your hands on your own body, please. I look for the longest one. That's right, Jacob. This is the shortest one. Who remembers what the name of this work is? Raise your hand if you remember. Jacob. Oh, yes. When I go like this, it means get quiet. You're right. Um, Jacob, do you remember what the name of this work is? The Red Rods. I'm going to put them back on the shelf. There is a very special way to put this work back on the shelf. To put it back, I need to put the longest one first. So I'm gonna take this one first. I'm gonna ask my friend Jacintha. Which one is the longest on the on the rug? Like, mm -hmm. 
Can you show me how you yeah. can you show me how you carry it? Beautiful. All the way to here. I'm gonna invite friends who are not making any sound. Bayesa, would you like to take the next longest one? Well, watch how carefully Bayesa is gonna carry it. Yeah, so I'm not gonna invite him for a turn. It's very sad. Thank you for carrying that so carefully. Thank you, and Bayesa, you put it exactly where it needs to go. Jacob, would you like to get the next one? Yes, Lola. Thank you, Jacob, that's exactly how that should go. Lola, would you like to get the next one? Can you show me how you carry it carefully? Thank you. Emmanuel, would you like to get the next one? Can you show me how you carry it safely the whole time? Thank you. And you can put your, your mask on the piano since you're not using it. My friend Gabby, would you like to get the next one? Friends, look here at the shelf. This is ready for the next friend, isn't it? Yeah, this looks perfect for the next friend. If you see that a work on the shelf does not look ready for the next friend, if you know how to fix it, you can fix it. Or if you're not sure, you can come and tell me and we can figure out how to fix it, okay? I'm gonna ask my friend Jacintha. Can you roll up the rug? Would you like to? Okay. You picked me that means I'm happy and smiling and blushing. You're even blushing? Look at her. Oh. She's doing a beautiful job. Is there, thank you so much. And I love how Jacinta walked around the circle. Did you notice? It was very polite. Yes. And she's gonna walk around the circle again. Right, why don't we sit at the circle with our hands back like this? Yeah, that would hurt our fingers. That friend might trip over us. And they might fall into someone else. Yeah, the first rule in our school is to be safe, right? Be safe. We should be safe and we should be kind. And we should be curious. Wow, you made a really interesting pattern. I like how it makes a little zigzag like that. You put this one right in the middle. Let's slide them all over and let's see. Can you slide all those over? I'm gonna show you something.
And you notice that each one is just this much longer. If you add this to each one, it's the same size. Can you show me how you do it? See, now it's the same size. If you put it there, that's the same size. Pretty neat, huh? Right, if you're ready to put them, when you're ready to put them back, remember start with the longest one first and make sure you hold it with two hands, okay?